when you decide you took the decision of getting into mph and but there are a lot of colleges in india and you know of course there are some good colleges there are bad colleges so how did you go about choosing your course and college what were some of the decisions that you took would you recommend that people don't go ahead for certain colleges and go ahead for certain specific colleges so could you shed some light on that as well okay um so uh i would like to start by naming a few colleges that provide this course okay so there is uh, starting with there is tata institute of social sciences it is mumbai then there are uh, iiph indian institute of public health uh, a lot lot of them uh, which is under public health foundation of india so there is iiph delhi gandhi nagar hyderabad i think shillong also and uh, then uh, there are uh, there is uh, shri chitra tirunal institute of medical sciences and technology trivandrum that is also a good college then we have pgi chandigarh which is post graduate institute of medical education and research then mm, we have our very own manipal's prasanna school of public health yes, yes. Uh, so these are the few colleges that are coming on the top of my head and which uh, provide a promising course uh so how i chose is that um so there were a few seniors who were uh, studying at tis right so tis was my target college to get in but i did not uh, uh, so tis basically all these colleges have their own entrance examinations that you have, that you have to clear so i was not able to uh, cut up. after the interview process of that college and my second option was always iiph because it is led by public health foundation of india and i had heard good things about it so that's how i went ahead with iiph gandhi nagar yeah uh, i think essentially that is the only thinking that i did i knew that i wanted to get into tis and if i don't get into tis iiph would be my option and i took it that way yeah right. and it has turned out it's fine pretty well it? obviously yeah obviously yeah um to so, um, um is there any like are there any jaise um let's say are there any colleges which people should not go for matlab i'm not saying ki hum kisi college ko aise bad mouth kar rahe hain but you know mm-hmm. in general because obviously after doing a masters degree you do look at ki ha you want a good stable job and income but do all colleges provide it because in sense let's say mba mein aisa nahi hota mba mein some colleges are good some colleges are not that great so mm-hmm. similarly is that the case with mph as well now if you if we compare it with mba mba is a more established course like you know right. i think ages se karte aa rahe hain log mph might not be like that so right. i think the options that we have is also limited limited right yeah right. so we cannot say i don't think we can pick out good and bad colleges uh-huh. yeah uh, yeah as a uh, like the colleges that are part of uh, you know for example like how i named pgi chandigarh that is right. a medical college right? right and they have a school of public health and community medicine right, right? so these right. i think these kind of colleges uh, give you a very first hand experience since it is a part of a medical mm-hmm. college right but then uh, then how indian institute of public health is it is only about public health there's nothing else that is going on there right there's right. just health there are courses in health administration public health and things like that so what i'm trying to say is all places will have their own advantages and right. disadvantages but uh, mph is you know i don't think we have a lot of uh, options for colleges so, so yeah whatever is there i think they are doing pretty good pretty well i think the student take has been great so yes i would say i don't think there are bad colleges like that it's just that it's your decision your uh, instincts and uh, your activities that matter got it got it okay so um ma'am the next thing that i wanted to a question me ko isi se aise bifurcate me aaya was um let's say uh you've done an mph so is it a globally recognized degree jaise hamara jo degree hai bds it's not recognized outside we have to do some licensing procedures to practice so post mph which mostly i think ki obviously nahi hoga recognized because m- 
public health is specific to public the country that yeah. you're doing it in mm -hmm. but uh, what are there good like because people have asked me this that can we go out after doing an mph from india is that a possibility or no i don't think i uh, you know i don't think i know a lot about this because this is something that i've not explored that much but there are uh, courses like doctor of public health courses that are there outside and they need a master's before that a master's in public health okay. which is essential so i think in those cases our degree might help but uh, right. i don't know if it is recognized completely outside as well right right yeah which mm -hmm. i think mostly nahi hoga because yahan ka public health if you compare it to the u the uk or maybe the us to obviously zameen aasman ka farak hai because we yeah, have different issues. Pub, all countries have different public health needs that right. is also there different continents have different public health needs so yeah obviously. it might be different hmm. right right 